people driving in Tampa may roll up on this weird looking van. A 360 degree camera, laser beams hanging off the sides. It's an expensive truck that the city hopes will save motorists a costly headache. So I got a flat tire just uh, driving out of the neighborhood. Potholes. Kimberly Moros hit one just last week. So it was really frustrating because I have to have my car towed and it's just a real pain. Over the next several weeks, this van will drive over every bit of 1,500 miles of pavement that the city of Tampa maintains. Laser beams and cameras that can see down to the millimeter will analyze each roadway and that data goes into a computer program that triages which road should be prepared and in what order. That's going to help us to prioritize and figure out where we need to put the put our limited funds, where we need to put those first. Laura says she would like to learn more about that computer program. Well, I'd be interested in what the criteria is. So far this year, the city of Tampa has filled more than 570 potholes. This road survey they're doing is not cheap. The total cost to contract the van and the study that comes afterwards is $533,000, but it's more cost effective. Doing an automated survey like this actually does save the city quite a bit of money. It helps us to leverage our resources more efficiently. Efficient for the city, and if it cuts down on tire repairs, Kimberly's on board. Of course, I'm always happy that my tax dollars are going to uh, being used. So you got to keep in mind that each major city has to do some sort of road survey. They say, of course, doing it with the high tech van, a little more expensive, but in the long run, it's more efficient than having human beings come out here and survey each road. And Linda, Cynthia, you have to remember that it's also safer. Right. And, and at least they have a plan, Dan. <laughs> Thanks.